Joyce, and thanks for tuning in to another episode of Scenes by Joy. And guess what? Guess what? We done made it to day 17. We done made it to day 17. Bow of the Vlogmas Challenge. So, anywho, I thought for today, we ought to do a haul. Now, y'all remember that video where I was complaining about my finances, and I was like, Joyce, what happened to all of your miscellaneous money? Why are you so broke? I don't remember going crazy this month. You guys, <laughs> that Black Friday sale, that Black Friday sale had your girl in a chokehold. And what's crazy is that what I'm showing y'all today isn't everything I got. It, it's not even close to everything I got. I have two packages coming in from Pretty Little Things. I ordered two pair of Lorve glasses. Keep in mind, I already got the Lorve glasses, but I'm waiting to unbox those until my pretty little thing package get here because they go together. I'm taking that stuff to my trip, so that's gonna be a different haul. Now, the haul that I'm doing today will try on haul. The try on haul I'm doing today is just the items that I bought that was on sale just to kind of have some fall, winter gear, you know, have something for Christmas, have something when I go out. Also, I'm part of a bridal party and then there's a bridal shower coming up so i also got a dress for that so today we are going to look at everything i have purchased how it looks on me and i'm going to give you all my feedback on all the items that i have okay starting with this outfit now i got this from dolls kill i really like this sweater my only thing is make sure that you have a black bra on because and I'm looking at my mirror over here because the bra I have on have like a little leopard print in there. But I really like this. I think it'll be good for like the fall, winter. It do not get that hot in Texas during the winter time. It was just 77 degrees literally the other day. So I have no complaints with this. This I can um, still wear this in springtime. I think it's cute. I think it's comfy. You know, it's giving a little lounge but still sexy. And then I also bought these knit leggings. Now, y'all really can't see these as good because I'm short, but my only complaint with these is that I'm too short for them. Like, they go up super high, and then they have a slit. A slit, I don't think I can really see it, but yeah. They have a slit at the bottom, but you can't really tell that I, can y'all see this? Yeah, you can't really tell that I have a slit at the bottom because I'm so short and the pants are so long. So I would say that's my only complaint about these leggings. But honestly, they are comfortable, like very comfortable. But I probably will wear some platform boots so they're not dragging on the ground. And this may just be my Christmas outfit to keep it 100 with y'all because I'm gonna be eating, I'm gonna be traveling, I want to be cute, but I want to be comfortable. So I'm probably going to put these docks with them. I love these shoes. I wear these shoes probably every single day. So I probably put these docks on with them. I'll have a fresh new hairstyle and just layer with it. I don't know what type of jacket I'm going to wear, but hold up. I did get this jacket. This is part of the haul too. I got this jacket from H&M y'all this is so fly one thing about me when it comes to my style i don't have one style i can be super girly one day i can be grunge another day street style head to toe like i don't have one style i will wear anything i just love clothes period and this jacket i got from h m like i said and i'm feeling it like i'm feeling it it's giving swah and I was thinking about putting this jacket on with this, but mm -mm. it's giving two different, two different vibes. And honestly, it probably won't even be hot on Christmas, so I probably don't need a jacket. But I'm just gonna go ahead and try this on with this. I'm not gonna wear it together, but I just want you all to kind of see how it looks on, how it fits. Oh yeah, oh yeah, this is so me. Do we have pockets? Oh yeah. This is so me. I love a good oversized jacket. I love the puffiness. I love the details of the strings. I love the back of it. Oh, this is one of my faves for sure. Like this is gonna get worn 
a lot. So this is a happy, happy purchase. So the jacket is a yes, the sweater is a yes. I mean, on a scale from one to 10, I would give the knit leggings probably six and a half, seven. You know, I would give them a nine for comfort level, but just the fact that they're so long, and let me remind y'all, the leggings came from Doyle's Kill, the sweater came from Doyle's Kill, the jacket is from H&M. But just the fact that they're so long, I cannot dress these up or wear these out. And then if I want to wear a crop top, it would just look stupid because like I said, they come up extremely high. And I mean, I want the fupa to be hidden, but I don't want it up to my heart, up to my chest. Like that's just, that's too high. You guys, that's too high. But I'm probably gonna wear these out because they're simply comfortable and I love loungewear, so they will get worn, okay? Okay, you guys, so this is my second purchase from H&M. And it's just a little oversized hoodie. What does it say? Y'all, I don't even know what it's saying. I don't know what it say. Can y'all read this? It says black something. I don't know. But anyways, I'm feeling it. I am a hoodie girl. Like, I love a good oversized hoodie. And the thing is, I mean, it's kind of short at the back. I mean, a little bit of cheeks out. But I would definitely put on some thigh-high boots and probably just some spanks underneath and wear this as a dress. I would. Hair down, maybe a hat, put on a jacket over it, or just wear it just like this. I definitely would. Give me a little purse and she's giving. She's giving you winter sled. She's giving you, well, fall time over, ain't it? Well, yeah, I think fall time over, but she's giving you winter sweat. She's giving you covered, but sexy. She's giving you looks. So I love this hoodie. And then this is an all purpose hoodie. Like I said, I would put thigh highs on with this, but on them days I'm feeling lazy for work, I would just throw this bad boy on. So I give this a 10 out of 10. Okay, I'm going to hold my titties because my nipples are showing. <laughs> and I know some of my students watch my YouTube videos, so I'm just gonna cover my boobs like this. This dress was probably like five bucks and I just got it as a lounge dress for my vacation and honey i love it i mean your girl gotta lose a little bit more weight but i'm feeling it and the thing is i'm not gonna wear a bra or nipple covers when i go on vacation i am only holding my boobs for video purposes but i'm always skeptical about buying dresses from h&m because sometimes they don't fit me right but she is giving she is giving little black dress and I like, so I would definitely give her, when I give her 10, let me give her. I wish she had a little bit more spandex, just a little bit more spandex, because y'all probably can see, y'all probably can see my fupa a little bit. I'm trying to hold it in. Let me look in the mirror, whatever. I wish she had a little bit more spandex to push a girl in, but I plan on being 10 pounds lighter than what I am between now and my vacation. So I give her, I give her an 8.5. I definitely do. She's a cute little throw on dress. No complaints about this. All right, y'all. So I just threw this sweater back on because I didn't have a top to put on with these pants. But I got these pants. Make sure my phone got out. I got these pants from H&M. And I like them. Honestly, these were just some work pants <laughs> that I just purchased. I'm like, okay, these are on sale. And I kind of... Let me kick my lid up. Okay, if y'all can kind of tell, they're high water. Like they cut off short purposely, but that's cool because I probably will put on either my docks or another pair of black boots that I got. Or if I get some new booties with them, I, I like that look when the pants are kind of flooding, but you put on a boot with them so you can really see the detail of the boot. But yes, they're, let me check it out. They're a solid brown, you know, I like the color. I think it matched my skin complexion well. And they feel good, like they're a good fit. H&M. These were on sale too. Good little work pants. I can dress them up. I can dress them down. So, yes. These are good to go. Definitely. Once again, I wish they had a little bit more spandex. In them. Just a little bit more. See, that's thing is when you when you ball on the budget. When you don't we don't pay that little extra extra. And the thing is, H&M really isn't cheap. It really is not cheap. But you know the difference between like a $8 on 
sell pair of pants and like a $50 and up pair of pants because the way they just hold you in and I'm really big now about quality about how I look at my clothes so the only complaint I would have is that I wish it was just a little bit more spandex because there's they're spandex pants you know I just wish it kind of just claps me in a little bit more but like I said my, my fat ass just need to lose a little bit more weight and then my clothes will fit how I want them to fit but until then I want to buy clothes that just helps me out and I'm looking back and forth between y'all and my mirror. I just want some clothes that'll kind of help me out in the process. But that's a good to go. I'll give them an eight out of 10. Okay, you guys, so yeah, this is definitely getting returned. And what's crazy, I look like I'm built like a beluga well in this. Like, well, this is showing every imperfection and flaw. I don't even want to record far back. Like, Y'all, this dress is showing every imperfection and pudge on my body. This dress is a no. And what's crazy, I was super excited for this dress. Like, this dress was fucking expensive. I got this dress from Aritzia. And one of the YouTube girls was talking about this clothing line, store, whatever. I think their sisters would express. And this dress was originally $98. I think I got it on sale for like 50 something dollars. It's going back. Because online, it looked like it was tight. It looked like it was thick. This is thin. Like the whole reason why I have, can y'all see? The whole reason why I have out this pair of sculpts and these two pair of Steve Maddens is because I was gonna have y'all help me pick out what boots I should wear with this dress because I was supposed to wear this dress to my friend's bridal shower. And it's giving a hell fucking no. I give this a zero out of 10. Aricia, y'all need y'all ass whoop for that. Because I'm like, who would have paid $98 for this dress? And it's like, I know I need to lose weight. I know that. And I'm working on that, but there is no reason. Ooh, <laughs> my bad. I, like, there is no reason why this dress should look the way it. Even my. Oh no. I mean, I don't have my best bra on today, but no. Oh, I hate it. I'm disgusted. Zero out of ten. Aritzia. Boo. Like, I got one more thing from Aritzia, and it better. And it better meet my expectations or I promise I'm never shopping with you all again. This, no. Like maybe for a, I wouldn't even recommend this dress for like a petite skinny girl because it's, it's loose. Like what size are you supposed to get it in? Like I think this is a size, what size is this? This is a medium. That means I should have got this dress like in a small or extra small for it to fit tight. It's loose, it's see-through. Like even if you were super petite, I just feel like it would swallow you. I don't know. And I, oh, I was so excited about this dress. Mm. Okay guys, and no, I did not buy these two things to get fixed. This bodysuit is from Aritzia. These sweats are from Forever 21. And I too like this bodysuit a lot. It's good quality, guys. So, yeah, the bodysuit is giving. It's good spandex material. I love this open cut right here. And honestly, I got this bodysuit. I didn't know what I was going to do with it, but I want to do a personal photo shoot. Also, do not have your hair done before you put this bodysuit on. Like, it's where I'm a whole ponytail. That's why I just wrapped it up in this bun. But yes, put the bodysuit on first, then do your hair. But I really like this. So I'm planning a photo shoot for myself and my best friend is a stylist and I wanted her to style me. And I told her I had this. So she styled me a very cute outfit with this bodysuit and I am extremely happy with the purchase. Now, Aritzia, I give you 10 out of 10, okay? And it's a thong bodysuit, so you don't have to worry about panty line or nothing like that. Y'all kind of want me back with that. But this right here, Baby, I'm getting my $50 back. Y'all, this looks so good online. It looks so good. And honestly, I want to screenshot it. I want to screenshot it and insert how this dress looked online because that's how they got me. But they don't get me again, I promise. The only thing that I would buy from Aritzia is probably the bodysuits. And honestly, when I was watching my YouTube girl, I can't remember which YouTube girl I was watching. When she was showing off Aritzia, she was talking about the bodysuits. She was giving them props on this. So I think bodysuits is just their specialty. 
So I just need to stay in that lane when shopping with them. But because of this bodysuit, I probably will purchase another one with them. And these sweats, the rest of the stuff that I got is just little stuff that I picked up from Forever 21. I'm not even gonna try it on because I tried it on in the store. I already know how it fits. And these sweats, I already knew how they fit, but I just told mom because I didn't have no pants to wear with this. But these sweats are super comfy. On my vacation, they probably will be part of my airport, um, part of my airport outfit. I have a gray bodysuit that I can throw on with these. So I love these cheap. Everything in Feb 21 was 40% off. And honestly, I bought a ton of stuff from there. But these are just the items I have not worn yet. And I was like, why not just throw them into the haul? But it's yes, got these sweats. Um, got these black pants. And honestly, for Feb 21, y'all. Cause I bought two pair of jeans from them too and they some good quality jeans. And you know, good quality jeans are hard to find. These are some good quality black pants, you guys. I was shocked. I was shocked that I ever had these. And you can never have too many pair of black pants. You can never go wrong with a black pair of pants. And I was gonna put these on to go with this, but the blacks don't match. So the thing is, don't assume just cause you got a black top, that black pants go with it because I'm big about that. I hate when blacks don't match. But this was a good pair of pants. See if they still got these. Cause I probably paid like 10 bucks for these. Good deal. And I just got me, they had like some of these. I wore a green one in one of my YouTube videos. Which YouTube video was it? I think it was the one about seasonal depression. So I got that from Forever 21. And then I had copped this one as well. And this is just if I want to run to the bar or if I'm just lounging or it's a lazy day at work. I just want to throw a sweatshirt on Forever 21. Hmm. Cute. 40% off. And then I had got some other graphic tees. Not the ones with Aaliyah and everybody else who don't pass away on. I'm sick of seeing them shirts, you guys. There's other graphic shirts to get. Damn. Stop wearing. Stop wearing B.I.G. N.W.A. and Aaliyah graphic shirts out. My God. But I got um, this graphic shirt with the little mushrooms on there. It was giving me Urban Outfitter vibes. And I was like, oh, this is a cute little, a cute little graphic tee from forever. And the thing is, I will wear a black tee out. I love a solid black tee. I look love a good graphic shirt because when I'm doing shoots and things like that, I like to be comfortable. So this was a good little purchase from Forever 21. So I like that a lot. And then y'all. Now Forever 21, I ain't gonna lie, some of that shit, like it's cheap and it looks cheap and it falls apart. But Forever 21 have cute jackets. And when I saw that this was 40% off, I had to cop. I look, in my closet, I probably have more jackets than anything. I own more jackets than anything else. It is so crazy because I barely go outside in the winter time. When it's super cold, I barely go outside. But I do have to go to work every day, so I like having a cute jacket on. And y'all, and nude is my favorite color. It's my all-time favorite color. And just, just even if I was to put it on with this bodysuit, I love this jacket. This is one of my favorite Feather 21 purchases. Like, I like this jacket a lot. This was a good buy. Like, it was so worth it. And I'm sending the dress back, but I guess I could show y'all the shoes that I was gonna put with it. So, I was gonna have y'all decide, cause I bought these books for Valentine's Day last year. And I had just worn them once. Have not worn them again. And I think these are so cute. They hurt your feet. Now, Scuts have some cute shoes, but y'all be prepared. They are not comfortable shoes because these shoes hurt, and then I had did a photo shoot for one of my friends, and she had a pair of scuffs, and they hurt her feet too. But I really like these. I was gonna ask y'all, should I wear these with it? But that was a no-go. And then I had these little numbers right here. I only wore these one time last year for Galentine's, and I just been trying to find an excuse to wear them again. I got these from Steve Madden. I really like these a lot, super girly, super fun. And I was gonna do like a pink lip with that dress for the bridal shower, you know, do cream, do pink, cherry blossom little number, but we gotta find a new dress, you guys. So I was gonna ask, should I wear this pair? Or, or I had this other pair. Y'all, it was crazy, I done 
wore all these shoes only one time. <laughs> only one. Or these super thigh highs from Steve Madden as well. I was like, should I do a little brown on brown number? Because originally I wanted to get like a tan trench coat to go with this dress. I wanted a tan long trench coat to go with this. And I was just gonna do cream and brown and nude with it. But no, nah, so I was gonna say, should I do these shoes with them? But now we don't know. We will never know because I'm not wearing that dress and it's going back. So yeah, and if they won't accept it back because it was on sale, I'm selling it. Regardless, I'm getting them rid of. So yes, you guys, that was my little haul, my little fall slash winter gear, which I believe we're technically in winter now. But these are just some little pieces that I got. We have to find another bridal shower dress. That's just annoying me. But at least the photo shoot body suit worked out. Everything else worked out. I have another haul coming soon. I'm waiting on my package from Pretty Little Things to come in. So I can show you my Lord Bay glasses. I'm so excited. And then the pieces that I got to go with the Lord Bay glasses. So until next time. And as always, like, comment, and subscribe. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.